Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another new video. So I had recently been to Dubai airport. I was going from Bangalore to Norway just a couple of weeks ago. And my layover in Dubai airport terminal 3 was for 8 hours. And of course, when, when it comes to Dubai, all that you care about is buying an iPhone in Dubai airport. So if you're transiting, you can buy iPhone, there is no problem. So in this video, I'll be showing you the prices of iPhone 16, iPhone 16 Plus, iPhone 16 Pro and iPhone 16 Pro Max. So I'll be explaining you all the prices in detail and I'll be showing you a quick uh, tour on uh, on those prices and on on my visit to uh, Apple store in Dubai Airport Terminal 3 and also you may have a lot of questions on VAT refund uh, do we need to pay VAT if you're buying in the airport uh, because it is duty free you may have a lot of questions guys so I'll be answering all of those questions in this video so my only humble request to you guys is watch this video till the end if you're going through Dubai or if any of your friends or family is transiting via Dubai Airport and you want to buy an iPhone this will really help you a lot to know what are the latest prices of iPhone because when once iPhone releases the prices they will not decrease it until the next iPhone 17 is launched so this prices is going to be consistent and if you are you don't have to enter the Dubai or city or you don't have to get, enter UAE itself just the airport you can buy iPhone for a very very cheap price I'll be discussing those prices in this video so watch this video till the end to gain maximum information so with Without wasting any time, let's go look at the prices. Hey guys, as you can see my screen, uh, I'll compare the prices in INR between Dubai and India. And as you can clearly see in my screen, there is a lot of difference. When you talk about iPhone 16 Pro Max, uh, 256 GB variant is 1450 USD, that is 1,21,000 in Dubai, where it is where, whereas in India it is 1,44,000. And also, um, when, when we speak about 512 GB, it is 1,675 USD, which is 1,40,000 in Dubai. But in India, it is 1, lakh 65,000 which is almost a difference of 25,000 rupees which is huge guys in my opinion and also 1 TB in iPhone 16 Pro Max is costing 1900 USD which is 1 lakh 59,000 in Dubai but 1 lakh 84,000 in India which is like the highest of difference and also when we move on to iPhone 16 Pro there is four variants 128 GB 256 GB 512 GB and 1 TB so 256 uh, 128 let's start off with 128 GB is costing 1 lakh 4,000 in Dubai but it is costing 1,20,000 in India and similarly 256 GB is costing 1,13,000 in uh, Dubai but it is costing 1,30,000 in India and the 512 GB is costing 1,31,000 uh, in India but in Dubai but it is costing 1,50,000 in India again there is a huge difference and also when it comes to uh, the last variant that is 1 TB variant it is costing 1,50,000 in Dubai where it is costing 1,70,000 in India again there is a huge difference guys and these prices on top of this you will have you might have GST as well in India and when we talk about normal iPhones that is iPhone uh, iPhone 16 and iPhone 16 Plus. Let's look at the prices of iPhone 16 Plus. There is only three variants available in um, iPhone 16 Plus, unfortunately. That is 128, 256, and 512. 128 in Plus is costing 84,000 in India, but only 89,000 in Dubai. So only 5,000 difference, guys. So if you're planning to buy iPhone 16 and iPhone 16 Plus, kindly buy in India itself because there is not much of difference. 128 GB is costing around 84,000 in uh, Dubai, but 89,000 in India, and it's costing uh, 93. 3000 in Dubai but 99,000 in India and similarly 512 GB is costing 1,12,000 in Dubai but 120k that is 1,20,000 in India and normal iPhones which most of us buy normal iPhones very compact very light and very small it's costing 75,000 for 128 GB in India but it's only costing 80 uh, in Dubai and it's only costing 80,000 in India and similarly uh, for 256 GB variant it is costing 84,000 in Dubai but 90,000 in India and also the 512 GB is costing 1,3,000 in Dubai but costing 1,10,000 in India. So there is really not much difference when it comes to iPhone 16 and iPhone 16 Plus guys. But if you are buying iPhone 16 Pro or iPhone 16 Pro Max, it is going to be very very beneficial for you. So in my opinion, if you, if you want to buy Pro and Pro Max only, visit Dubai or UAE but if you're planning to buy iPhone 16 and 16 plus I feel India is a better deal because for 5000 rupees you need not go to Dubai and actually buy it but you can buy this in India itself. So as you saw in the video those were the iPhone 16 Pro, Pro Max 16 and plus 
16 plus prices and the most important question that most of you asked me in my previous VAT refund video is if you are buying an iPhone in the city anywhere in UAE then you will have to pay a VAT which will be refunded in Dubai airport. Now I have made a dedicated video on how to get VAT refund for iPhone. Please watch this video. It is very very informative. And if you buy iPhone in Dubai airport because it is duty free you don't have to pay any VAT. It is completely VAT free which will really help you a lot. And you just have to pay what is shown in the video like I just showed you. And the same amount can be paid via credit card or via dirhams uh, via US dollars etc. And they are going to accept it and you can take the iPhone home. No questions will be asked even if you are getting to India because you have the bill and you are legally allowed to carry I think I am not really sure but two electronics as per the rules I will link the rules in the description below please do check it out I am really not confident but if you are buying one iPhone in Dubai airport and if you are coming to Bangalore with the bill it is completely safe guys you don't have to be uh, scared or worried about anything in the customs so I hope this video was very very informative please stay tuned to my channel and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this I will catch you guys in my next video